I think one of the things that makes our school district so phenomenal is that we have such wonderful support from our community. You can't separate the two. Our school district and community are intricately interwoven with one another. And as a result, we have got to have a, a, a strategic plan that involves our community and is community-based because it will only be together that we can reach the goals that we hope to achieve. One of the reasons that we engage in strategic planning is because we want to improve over time. While we have a, a history of excellence and a tremendous reputation, we don't want to rely on that reputation. We want to continue to get better each and every day, and strategic planning is one of the ways that we can make that happen. So one of our big focuses when it comes to this strategic plan process is to understand that this is our strategic plan that our strategic plan represents the efforts of not just the school district, but the community to move forward. And so it's been important for us to engage the community in those conversations. So all through this year, we have had uh, multiple community meetings in which we've asked people from across our school district, what are the skills and dispositions do our children need to thrive in their futures? And that conversation has really been the basis and the foundation of all of our strategic planning efforts. At our community meetings, we use an excerpt of the film, Most Likely to Succeed. We received such great feedback about that film that we wanted to show it in its entirety. So on February the 22nd, we are gonna hold two special screenings for the film, Most Likely to Succeed, at 6.30 p.m. And I would like to personally invite you to come be a part of the conversation and join in the fellowship as we talk about where Lexington One needs to be to continue to have graduates succeed in all that they do and for our children to have their dreams come true. We've taken the information from the community meetings, we've taken the feedback from our staffs and as well as from the board, and we've combined that information to help us identify high yield strategies that can help move our district forward. We're going to identify vision, we're going to identify our mission, we're going to define those power skills that our students need to survive in their, and thrive in their futures, and then we're going to identify our portfolio projects. And those portfolio projects are nothing more than those very specific strategies that will help keep us moving down the path towards continuous improvement. <music>